Well, each person has, is mixed, made up of different parts. And I think for me, I'm so marginalized that I bring that to the court, my marginalized lens. Um, what's interesting though about my marginalization, it comes from a place of disenfranchisement. So every label that has been assigned to me has been a powerless label. And I've transcended that powerlessness to a position that folks deem powerful. So, you know, being a black individual, being a woman, being an immigrant, you know, um, being, I identified as having a disability, I have a back condition. So all of them are, are marginalizations. I tend to see things more inclusive. I see the, the similarities in people, whereas most people see differences, I see similarities. Because I'm, I'm so intersectionality, intersected actually, I believe is the pr proper way of saying it. Um, I tend to see how we all kind of come together as one, you know. I see things through what I call an accommodating eyes. And I think my immigrant status, bring in my culture, bring in my different lens to the table, to bring in a lens from a completely different system onto this system, I think helps myself and my colleagues see the law in a more inclusive manner and not exclusive.